I'm getting my cooler ready. Not to go camping, so I can make smoke lay on the ground with my chill box. You're going to want to see this. Hi, this is JP Morgan. Today on the Slime Lens, I've got a quick tip for you. That is how to make a chill box. A chill box is a simple cooler that you run your smoke through that makes it lay flat on the ground. Like right now, if I turn on my smoke, it's just going to go straight out and up. It's not going to go out on the ground, which we don't want our smoke to go out and up. So we want a chill box. What I have here is a cooler. This cooler has had a hole cut in each end of it. I've got a dryer vent that I've just screwed screws into each end. So if there's a dryer vent, I just did that because it kind of cleans up the hole, makes it look a little nicer. Then inside, I've done a couple of things. Woo, smoke. I've got these little blocks of wood. I put these in here and then I just took an old grate from a uh, barbecue. I had it laying around the back and I set this on here. And when I'm doing dry ice, I use that grate because I lay the dry ice straight onto the grate. And as the smoke pumps in onto the dry ice, kind of underneath the dry ice, because dry ice drops down, it cools the smoke and then it pushes it out this other end and it comes right out on the ground. Stop that. Got a possessed uh, smoke machine over there. For a block of ice, I'm not going to use this because block of ice is not like dry ice. It does not cool down. I'm going to want this smoke to go over the top of the ice. So I'm going to take my block of ice. I'm going to shove my block of ice right next to where the smoke comes in. So the smoke's going to envelop all around it. And we're going to turn it on and see if our smoke comes out on the ground. There we go. Drops right on the ground like fog. It's beautiful. So with your chill box, you're running your smoke through it and it's just going to lay out on the ground. It's going to just keep pumping it through the chill box. It'll just keep laying down. Right now that smoke is laying on the floor all around behind me. Unfortunately, I got a leak over here. So you're not seeing my face like I want you to see my face. But look at that, it just keeps pouring out of there. It's beautiful. It's a beautiful look and a beautiful effect. And for what? The price of a cooler and a block of ice. You can use your Roscoe uh, smoke machine. This is a Roscoe Mini, which we love. These work fabulously. I use the Stage and Studio smoke because it dissipates a little quicker. But if you're outside, use their heavy smoke because it'll lay on the ground for a lot longer. Stage and Studio, Roscoe Fog Fluid. This one dissipates quickly. This one hangs around a lot longer. You decide. If you want to make sure you don't have this smoke going around like this, all over the place. Just put your ice in, put your lid down, and then get out your gaff tack. Where's the gaff tack? Then get out your gaff tack. And tape up the edge right there, yeah. Yeah. Wrong edge. <laughs> So for step-by-step -step instructions on how to create your chill box, go to the link below. It's one of our lessons we did previously. It'll show you exactly what to do. This is a simple effect, but a beautiful look. You can use any smoker to do this with, but you got to make your own chill box because they're pretty hard to find. Actually, you can't find them. So check it out. Keep those cameras rolling. Keep on clicking. So check it out. Keep that fog flowing and keep on chilling. Our Mastering Studio Strobes download was put together to help you overcome the fears that people have getting into the world of strobes. It's going to answer the question of what strobe should I buy? What's best for me? It'll help you understand how to sync them. It'll help you understand what modifiers you should purchase. It's going to help you understand all the questions you need to know to move comfortably into the world of strobes. So go to thesliningless.com where you can download it today. Subscribe to the Slime Lens or we're going to disappear into a cloud of smoke like poof. You don't want that.